continue the prayers for him. The more prayers we have, maybe God will answer our prayers and give him the healing that he needs. George Custer is asking people to do what they've been doing since his son, 19-year-old Ryan Custer, was hurt at a party in Oxford more than a week ago. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. His father says the elder grad and Wright State basketball standout hit someone's knee diving into a makeshift pool. He suffered a traumatic head injury. Through several surgeries, removing fragments, shaving part of his vertebrae, and fusing them together, Ryan's father says his son's progress has been encouraging as the swelling goes down. And now we just have to wait till it goes down because there's really not much more they can do for him surgically. He says Ryan will go to Chicago Friday to be considered for a stem cell study at Rush University. It could be the key to his recovery. While Ryan's touch and movement in his fingers has improved, from the waist down, progress is much slower. His friends and family are visiting him every day, encouraging him, and new shirts with the word believe are being made to help cover his recovery costs. I wouldn't say it's a miracle, but to see him at this point, what we thought he was in the beginning and where he is now, this has been tremendous. Those close to him say Ryan believes, and so do they. He, of course, is nervous and scared for the future. He's not sure what's going to happen, um, but we've assured him that he's not going to make this journey alone. We'll be right there with him.